point because we're looking at the most severe outcome of influenza, which is death. And between 2010 and 2015, I think it was, they identified 358 kids in the U.S. that died of influenza, a completely preventable death. And what they found, and they, they did a very good uh, case control study, what they found was that if we gave these kids vaccine, we could protect them about 65% of the time. The vaccine's not a perfect vaccine, but we could prevent about 65% of those deaths. Importantly, even in children who had severe medical problems, complications that um, if they were to get influenza, almost certainly they're gonna develop a complication, if not die from it. 50% of those kids were protected. Now this is really important because there's the sense out there that it's, quote, just the flu. Getting that message across to parents that even though you have a young, healthy kid, and even though we didn't have flu vaccines when you were a kid, and, and yeah, you survived it, it doesn't mean that everybody's going to. And this is particularly a problem for kids that have asthma, that have heart problems, diabetes, and all of those are more common in our society than when we were kids.